God. Yeah, this is gonna be this is gonna be the last day we're using this as a background as well, isn't it? Anyways, what's up, buddies? Welcome to uh, another. I was about to say the final episode of the format. Oh my God! This epi's already ruined. I just told my Twitch stream that I'm gonna ruin this episode because I have or this intro because I have absolutely nothing planned. Anyways, this is the final episode of the Christmas themes. So Merry Christmas to you guys, man. You'll be watching this video very early Christmas morning if you're not doing stuff with your family or maybe you're watching this episode on a brand new iPhone if you're a spoiled butch or maybe you're watching it on an iPad if you're a spoiled brat. Either way, Merry Christmas. Hopefully you're enjoying your new electronics and I don't know why the hell you'd be watching me on your new electronics, but God bless. Merry Christmas, bros. For those of you guys that don't celebrate Christmas, happy holidays or happy... Tuesday and uh, I just want to say I love you guys man I appreciate the support over another amazing year crazy to think that we're a week away now from 2019 or just over a week away from 2019 it's been an absolutely nutty five plus year journey as a content creator specifically on Twitch and then yeah I guess we decided to start doing YouTube like 2014 January 2014 so we're at basically five years on YouTube as well so just wanted to say I appreciate you guys. Y'all are absolutely amazing. Um, you know, you, you help me support my family and put, put a roof over my family's head and allow my wife to deliver stuff like this. The world which looks horrible on stream. But that is the biggest cheese. What is this? Omelette. It's an omelette? <laughs> this plate is bigger than my head! Thank you. I appreciate you. Hey, just wondering... How do you feel about no? I have not had a coffee yet. Well, you should have a coffee. And then when you're having it, like, just pour it in mine. Thank you. Merry Christmas. Ha ha ha. God bless. Steph always needs to make an intro while we're doing an intro, doesn't she? Anyways, I love you guys. Merry Christmas. Hopefully you had a great Christmas. Um, you know, obviously I wish and hope that you guys got whatever you wanted to, uh, whatever you wanted for Christmas specifically. And... I do hope that it's more along the family lines of things and not the material lines of things. Now, um, I do know that normally we do a uh, big giveaway for the streams and we've done so many giveaways this last week. Uh, I mean, I've done just it for the Twitch and the YouTube stuff, about $2,000 worth of PayPal and sub giveaways and all of that stuff and, and gifted subs to non-subs, actually probably quite a bit more than that. Um, so what I was thinking of doing for uh, in honor of this epi and then in honor of this Christmas Eve stream as well is that we're going to do a nice big uh, donation to charity in honor of all of you guys. I think that's maybe something that I think will help input a little bit of Christmas spirit. So for our uh, cancer research page, we'll be dropping um, a big donation at the end of it. So if you want to check that out, the links as always are in the description. If you're motivated to, to want to do a little bit extra, the pages for the cancer research page um, are still taking obviously donations to support cancer research. So that link is in the description down below. And, and I love you guys, man. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas. Hopefully you guys um, are just having a great time, whatever that means to you, right? Because I always get messages from people saying, oh, you know, I don't really celebrate Christmas or I don't talk to my parents or whatever. So whatever you're able to do and enjoy during this festive period and whether that is just playing fun or enjoying content on youtube i hope you enjoy it to its fullest extent so god bless you guys today's epi though other than it being christmas um should be a pretty fun epi i think in about three minutes we're getting the final set of futmas cards um i've got to review how the weekend league went i didn't play my games unfortunately i didn't get like being that it's christmas time i had a huge cousin's christmas party at our house speaking of which do I cringe you guys out and show you the, the Instagram picture so you guys at least get an idea of how many people were in my house yesterday? Um, I think this is missing a few people. I think one of my cousins left as well. Look at this effort, man! Who's the girl two to the left of Ethan? Does she have Insta? Two to the left. That's my sister! You dickhead! That's my sister, you penis! You stay away, moron! She's 15, you psycho. Um, anyways, this is my family. There's my little brother, by the way. Um, there's all my, well, this is literally just all my cousins and, you know, brothers and family and Mila and Ethan and all of that stuff. Anyways, it was great. It was an absolutely fantastic festive period, man. We had a great time tonight. 
we're going to a big Christmas dinner as well at Steph's side of the family. Um, and that's the exact reason why I wasn't able to finish my Fut Champ games. However, we did turn things around. I think you guys saw last episode, we used this team and I went from eight and five with the Brazilian shithouse team because of the silver goalkeeper and just the team wasn't working. Um, we went from eight and five to 17 and five with that team that I put together. So Patrick Van Anholt, Rivaldo was actually starting to do well. And then I believe I tried to continue on, but I was running out of time and I went from 17 and five. I took a loss. Then I got a win. Then I took a really sweaty loss and we went to like 18 and seven. Wait, 17, and five, 17. And yeah, we went to 18 and seven and I ran out of time and I was like, I got to stop, man. I, I want to rip my face off. It's Christmas. And this game is making me so irritated. So I just stopped. So for this week, we left, what would that be? Uh, we left six games on the table. No, six games on the table? Five games on the table, which is unfortunate, but sometimes you got to do with what you got to do. But I will say this real quick before we get into things. Um, oh, hold on. It's fun, Mr. Who cares? We'll talk about the team in a second. We got the new SBCs. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Debrina! Holy Merry Christmas! Oh my god! Dude, this is gonna be like a 95 rated squad. For sure. Oh! What is that? Wait, what? 88 rated. 88 rated. Five team of the weeks. <laughs> what is this requirement? Dude, I don't know what the cost is. Five team of the weeks that are 88 rated. Bro, what is this? A million coins. Dude, hold on a second. Is that a million coins? That's a million coins, isn't it? Dude, hold on a second. I need this card. Are you... F it is a 93 De Bruyne. It is a 93 De Bruyne. Right? I mean, that's a banger of a card, dude. That is an insane card. Six to 800k, bro. That's going to put such a huge dent in our SBC. Rec oh my god, bro. I don't know what to do. Oh my God, I don't know what to do. This card is worth its weight in gold, man, for sure. Wow, bro, what a card. I kind of need this in my life, man. I kind of need this Debrina in my life, man. And I didn't even look at that boa tank, dude. That boa tank looks good too. I don't even need this boa tank. I have a pack pulled boa tank as it is. Wow, 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 wow. Did EA did EA post anything at all? Madness. Merry Christmas. Really at the end of the day to EA Sports, right, dudes? We end the Bummest Countdown with some KDB for your holiday needs. Interesting. I gotta check out that Super Sitch, man. I, 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 I mean, I do have a Gigi Buffon, but okay. Oh, is there a new icon? Oh my gosh, is there a new icon as well? Are you kidding me? Three team of the weeks and eighty-five rated squad, bro. My goodness. You know what? I'm not mad. At least this is this is a meta card. That's a meta card. I mean, it just is. Eighty-four reactions, eighty-six composure, dude. I mean, you either give them... I mean, the stamina of 70 looks kind of trash, but center backs don't need much better. And you could also just give them an anchor. 83 sprint speed, 75 acceleration, or you give them a shadow. 88 sprint speed um, and 85 acceleration. 99 everything defensively. Okay, so let's go check out the icons, dudes. So what do we, what do we got here? Raul! Raul! Okay. 
This will set the tone for what his price is. What do you need for the loan? 82? 84? Well, I don't think I'm going to be testing out the loan, Raul. That's like 50k to do his loan. Okay. Well, that is... Okay, so you got silvers. Okay. Okay, there's a icon. 83, 84. 85, 86. And an 87 and an 88 rated squad. Huh. Okay, then. So what are you looking at the price? 1.7 to 2 mil, depending on how you put that together? What is he going for on the market, dude? Wait, how much is... is I mean, I know Raul's a good card. It's a pretty solid card. What's his card going for on the market, dudes? What are we seeing here? His SBC is pretty much the same price as his as his purchasable card on the market. Seriously? It's pretty much the same price as you just straight up buying them on the market and being able to sell them whenever the hell you want. He's top tier? It doesn't matter that he's top tier. It's that EA doesn't understand their own SBC system. Doing an SBC should be remarkably cheaper than buying the card off the market because your coins are gone. Your coins are vanished. They disappear, never to return because you're putting them into an untradeable card. He's like 100K, maybe 100K cheaper. Bro, that's, I mean, I know you get some packs and stuff like that, but you gotta take, take the understanding that the packs 99.9% .9 of the time are discard. See, that makes me a little bit worried. Considering the Raul is this expensive, bro, how much is, is a Cruyff that I would want? I can barely even afford this Raul right now if I wanted to do him. So, like, the, the, the Cruyff, I honestly think they're going to make the Cruyff be, like, 4 million coins to do. He's 4 million coins on the market, so let's make him 4 million coins as well. I mean, it's a card. This is this is a card. Like this is a nice card, man. Not gonna lie, I'd be very tempted to use this card as a right cam in the in the squad. Man, see, this is the biggest issue with all these these big SBC drops. Man, that that De Bruyne is monstrous. But if I get this card. For seven or eight hundred K, that's seven or eight hundred K completely gone. Completely gone from doing the icon SBC. And that's the unfortunate thing, man. PDB is like four hundred K. Are you sure about that? Whoa! Jordan! My god! Twenty yeah, gifted subs, man! That. Holy moly, dude. I appreciate you, buddy. Thank you. Nate, Pepsi, Fraud, uh, Piotrick with the tier the two. Thank you very much, man. Jordan with the 24. Overnight. Thank you for the 500 bits. Uh, that KDB is a ripoff. Basically, it's UCL card side by side head. comparison. Merry Christmas. Dude, crazy to think that at the start of the game, Nep basically packed this card. And Nep's been able to use hey, man. basically this De Bruyne since the start of the game Thanks for the sub! i mean okay he's got plus two for pace would you even notice that plus one shooting plus one passing plus one dribbling that's not that blows my mind even more that nep just has this card without even having to try on his rtg bro oh my god he's 600k i didn't even realize that brian was Santa's this expensive coming in town. Santa! There's no way. When KDB is a ripoff. It's basically his UCL card to a side by side comparison. BTW, Merry Christmas to chat and your family. Hashtag charity. Yo, same Amen. to you, brother. Same to you, man. God bless. Oh, I really want this card. You guys have no idea. Amen. KDB, KDB is an all time meta card, man. He really is. Your goddamn fucking moose shot me in the head. He really is.
Hey, man. You can do them for 500k? Bro, that's half a million coins! Hey, man. That's half a million coins, my dude! Hey, man. I don't even know how I would fit him in my team! I haven't even figured that out. That that, that technically hey, means that Gianfranco Zola doesn't have a spot. What, am I going to use Gianfranco Zola as a wide mid? Hey, man. As a striker? Where does that put Gianfranco? Hey, Shake yourself. I kind of want you. I'm not gonna lie, dudes. I'm gonna eat in front of you, man. This this egg this egg thing is making me want to eat hey, man. so bad. Hey man. He's end game. Hey man. You can't buy players, so this would be a good upgrade. Hey man. Hey man. Goddamn fucking moose shot me in the head. Mertens and Fabi as well for the links. And that's big. Goddamn money. fucking moose shot me in the head. That is big, big, big money, dudes. That is big money. Hey, man. I can't even use him, can I? Hey, man. <laughs> I can't, like, 86 rated. That's just going to kill the, um,. Holy moly, dude. Hey, man. Hey, man. The goddamn let fucking moose shot me in the head. Let me think this, let me think this through. Let, let, let's just organize a little bit here. The goddamn fucking moose shot me in the head. These guys are tradable, so I don't know if I use them yet. These guys are tradable, so I could sell them on. I mean, again, I could fucking just shot me in the head. put them here, just in case. Santa's I think 87 Santa. with three informs would have been reasonable. Oh no. Dude, I mean, that's, that's a team of the year caliber card, man. Poll. Could have at least been Lewandowski or Malik or something FFSEA. And BTW chat, your filthy mind's going after Nick's sister, someone has a word for you. Chris Hansen, why don't you come take a seat? N28 Kappa 1 anyways Merry Christmas hashtag charity less than 3 N28 love. Thank you Flip. fucking moose shot me in the head. Uh, I appreciate that. Yeah man. Asking about my sister you weirdos. 15 years old. Block out. Thank you for the 200 bits, by the way. Dab Conte Dab, thank you for the 6. Colorino, thank you for the 15. Broadster, thank you for the 3. Merry Christmas. Oh, God. Is it time? Oh, God. Maybe. Maybe it is time. I don't know. Oh, you're the best. Thanks. Okay. Thanks, babe. For this donkey... Am I, am I actually doing this? Am I actually doing this? Am I actually doing this? Still need a couple of informs too, which is crazy, dude. The goddamn fucking moose shot me in the head. It is 65 chem, which is, I guess, okay. I'm not saying I'm going to do uh, use Cruz. I'm just like organizing a little bit here and just seeing, seeing what what the actual cost might be for me, specifically. I think, I think one of the major issues, though. My God, dude, this is madness. Can't even use the reds. Well, again, EA made that, did that on purpose, dude. The last thing EA want is everybody to be able to get a KDB by rinsing all of their high-rated red cards, you know? I mean, you still can, but they don't count towards the informs.
Bro, I need a Belgian player. Forgot about that. I can't get rid of Courtois. He's too meta. He's way too meta. Ay, ay, ay. Dude, five team of the weeks is mad. Absolutely mad. Trying to figure out what card I can use here. More than more importantly. I do need an in I mean I do need an inform. I'm not getting rid of Chesney, you nuts. I'm not getting rid of Chesney, dude. He's so important to this club. He's packed pulled, man. Yeah, I'm not getting rid of Chesney. There's no chance. Um, let me just see how far away we are if I do something stupid like this. All right, we're one away. I need a Belgian and I need the chem. And I need an inform. That is mad. Okay. The goddamn fucking moose um, shot me in the head. I go for Drees. I'm not using my Drees Mertens either. You guys are insane. I'm not doing that at all. There's no chance. So that's crazy. We get we actually get the rating. So we don't get the chem. Uh ba -ba 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 -ba. Hold on, what the hell am I doing? Oh, maybe like an 88 rated inform or like a, like a PK or something? What is what is PK's inform going for? This is gross. This is too much, bros. This is too much. Oh, wow. That's like perfect. Oh, I still don't get the chem though. Really? Oh, wow. I thought for sure I'd get the chem. Wait, oh, hold on. That's not his team of the week. There we go. Jesus, Lord have mercy, dude. How, I mean, I guess people are trying to price fix certain cards, right? Is there an 84 rated German inform here I could use? Let's see special midfielder Bundesliga oh whoops does an 83 get us there Holy shit, it does, dude. On an inform again. There we go. Okay, that's not... It's not hey, super far away. This is crazy money, dudes. Holy, man. That is just nutty money, man. That, did I get more cam or loot? No, I, okay, I didn't. Yeah, I didn't get more cam, unfortunately. KDB is a god. I, I don't doubt that he's a god. Wait, what? That's even more hilarious. 
How did that just work out? Oh, because of Cruz now. Oh yeah, Cruz has the links he needs. Okay. Uh, so striker would get me one more chem. Center forward, get me one more chem. Center mid would get me another. I'd actually only need one more chem. Huh. This might be affordable. I mean, I'm getting rid of an insane amount of untradeables, and one of which is is this cruise, which is never going to get used, really. But it's still, it's not that it's cheap, dudes. This is still going to cost me 500k. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm basically paying 500k, whether or not. Um. That doesn't work, BBs. None of that matters. You're not really, though. No, I am, dude. I am absolutely getting rid of 500k. Like, there's no denying that. I'm, I'm putting 500k into this De Bruyne. They, they, fucking moose shot you guys that are so convinced that, Nick, this guy's untradeable, this guy's untradeable, this guy's untradeable, this guy's untradeable, he's untradeable. It's 500k, bros. There's, there's no denying that fact. There is absolutely no denying that fact. Is there a center back maybe in the Prem that would just get this done for me? We've got packs to open and stuff like that too. So, you know, it is what it is. But, uh, hmm. Hmm. You know what's crazy is this this De Bruyne you just know has skyrocketed the market. 86 get us there. I get the chem at that nice link, but doesn't. The goddamn fucking moose shot me in the head. Santa's coming in town. Santa! Oh my god! I need the 88. I need the 88 there. Mm, that's annoying. Uh, Theo, thank you for the four. Less than 500k? Is he less than 500k, dude? I don't even know if he is, man. I, I don't know if that's accurate anymore. With the way the market is shifting because of the uh, these cards... Bro, 88s are 40 fucking 2k, dude. You kidding me? He's under 500k with nobody in your club. How? How is he? How? How? Futbin is not accurate. There's no way. They have not, they have not, they've not anticipated or they're not calculating the big boost, the immediate boost in prices. Dude, 88s are like, even if you just don't have to buy informs, the 88s are gonna cost you 500k. What do you mean? How are you guys saying that this is 500k? It doesn't even make sense. Genuinely. The 88s alone are 500k minimum. Then you need 588 rated cards. There's no way this is 500k. And if Fudbin says that, I guarantee you in an hour or two, when it updates the prices, he's going to be like a million coins, man. And I bet you Mertens is probably overpriced right now, too. He's not that... I mean, still, 40k or 35k is still a lot. Man, I can't believe this. If it's not an icon for me, this is so tough to get rid of. You have the chem position with two and the loyalty glitch? I'm not doing the loyalty glitch, dude. I, I mean, I, I can literally just get a Serie A left mid, you know? And we're, we're set. Or, or whatever. Um... Actually, I don't lose much with that either. Yeah, like if I do, or oh, whatever, or a Bundesliga or a La Liga. So whatever we got here, let's see. Special, oh, it was Serie A. Oh, whoops, my bad. Got in the Serie A. Do we have an 84? Do. There it is. Done. 
right? So that's that set. I'm gonna have to spend. Uh, let's see what the average price is here. Okay, 30k on an El Shirawe. That's about so say 65k here. 65k. Why the hell is this guy so heavily price fixed? What the hell is this? That's 105k. I might have to find someone else. That's stupidly priced. 105k and then PK. So I, I'm gonna have to outlay about 150 to 200 k to do this De Bruyne while rinsing these players from the club. You're gonna love KDB. I have no doubts in my mind that I'm not gonna love KDB. Like I, 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 I genuinely have no doubts in my mind. I have no doubts that I'm gonna absolutely adore using this card. However, Getting rid of five to six hundred K's worth of cards. I need to decide. I need to decide where he goes. I need to decide where he goes. I regret not getting Hazard and Aubameyang. Yeah, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. You're not wrong. Pack a team of the year De Bruyne. Bro, leave it to me to do this red De Bruyne and then hit like his UCL card in the next set of UCL upgrade packs or something. So. Oh, actually. Should do... That, 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 and then De Bruyne there. So, even with this current squad, anyways, we've got we've got we've got a whole whole slew of of ways we can change and shift and upgrade this team if if I wanted to, right? But. goodness hmm the goddamn fucking moose shot me in the head the goddamn fucking moose shot me in the head gotta figure something out gotta figure something out the goddamn fucking moose shot me in the head. Oh, there we go. So, that. At, at right mid, he'll be, uh, he'll be on 7 chem? He'll be on 7 chem. Everyone else, everyone else will be on 10 chem. <clears throat> So then we'd have Jean-Franco Zola as my left cam, Royce as my right cam, De Bruyne as my central cam, Hyung Min Son as my striker, and then my dual DMs of Axel Witzel and um, and Fabinho, which I'm not happy with, by the way. Fabinho right mid? Uh, am I missing something here? Oh, it doesn't. That doesn't work. Walker at right back? Ah, uh, you know what, man? I'd, I'd rather use Alves on 8 chem. I'd rather use Alves on 8 chem than Walker on full chem. Dude, this card is insane. It, him on 8 chem does nothing. So, I mean, we can do it. We can definitely do it, bros. Uh -huh. 
It's it's whether or not we give this account a Christmas present, you know? And I mean, I guess over time, this Jean-Franco Zola can be replaced. Goddamn fucking moose shot me in the head. Right? By someone else. If I have a central cam in De Bruyne, don't really need um, Jean-Franco Zola anymore. Is that, how, how are we looking at here with this card? Yeah, I, dude, give this card a marksman. Like, holy shit. What a card. What a card. If you go 4 3 2 1, it'll be on full cam. If I go 4 3 2 1, it'll be Fabinho. Okay, so I can use a di I, I can set up a different formation as well. For sure. I'd rather have my DM be off of chem than my attacker, of course. Right? Now, the problem is, is however I set this up, there's there's going to be somebody that's off of chem. Right? Oh, my God, dude. This is tough, man. This is tough. Let's get let's get some packs open and see if maybe we could get a little bit lucky. Maybe maybe our pack luck can uh, can turn around. It'll make things easier, uh, an easier decision for me. All right, let's get rid of all this bronze crap. Yeah, so we'll be down to like what 1.5 mil. <clears throat> Got a hell of a lot of cards, dudes. I I have so much in this club, man. Dude, I could legit just sell off all of my OTWs and uh, and all of my Scream cards. That's another three, four hundred k right there. I can stop being a lazy idiot and sell all of my squad fitnesses instead of setting selling fifty or hundred a weekend. I could sell like just sell off the three to four hundred that we have left. I I could clear another six, seven, eight hundred k just by OTW Screams and consumables I have in my club, right? So that's something to consider. It's just the fact that... Hmm. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Would you use a Johan Cruyff at Striker? I mean, you know what? It's potentially the one thing that we need to think about is it's so far away, right? The fact that I'm even thinking about a Johan Cruyff right now, because then I'm thinking like we even even if a Cruyff comes out, I could rinse Zola into the Cruyff and use him at striker and have Hyung Min Son as my left cam. It's not the end of the world, right? Absolutely not the end of the world. Tried him and he was better at cam. Yeah, I mean, I, I, again, I don't know. I just do five, five, six hundred K into a De Bruyne. Five or six hundred K. Do we give ourselves a Christmas present? That's a tough one, man. I don't know why I'm having such difficulty answering that. All right, let's get the let's get the gold two-player upgrade packs going. Why the hell not? Screw that, man. Screw that. All right, we need to eat some of this egg while we're opening these stupid packs. Tough, man. Tough. Pack luck is tough, too, so it's not like I'm replenishing the club. Who do you think is going to be better in the foreseeable future? Well, team of the year cards. The thing is, man, is I'm stuck with this first owner series. So I might never get... I might never get 
anything better than a De Bruyne for Cam. I, I might, I might not. I might not. It might be all year, and I still don't get something better than a De Bruyne. Team of the Year card's gonna be expensive. Well, not only that, I I have to pack a Team of the Year card. It's like sick if there's a if there's a Team of the Year De Bruyne, let's say something crazy like that. It's like well, I, I need to try and pack that damn card, anyways. All right, I think I'm going to try and walk the walk that I talk, right? What I say to you guys all the time is, God damn, these packs are so shit. Anyways, it's like, it should be about trying to enjoy the game in its immediacy. That's not a word, but we're going to pretend like that's a word. It, 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 essentially living in the moment of the game. Like I've got 1.65 million coins. I've had the same basic squad for literally ever. Oh my god, we actually got a board. Wait, what? Is that a walkout? What the hell? Did I just get a walkout? God, he looks good in the lead kit. That's a walkout, bro! Yo! You guys owe me a thousand likes already! Merry Christmas to me! That's a sign. I can link him with the De Bruyne now. Yo! <laughs> How did I not see it? Because I'm being a moany botch. All right? I wasn't paying attention. How much is he worth? Your goddamn Anyways. fucking moose shot me in the head. Oh, good lord. Even matter, dude. That's not even anything to be happy about. We got that strong link, BB. Not that I need it, but I do now have a strong link hey, to Debrina. All right, let's get these pre-order packs in. Reels, thank you for the 23, man. Appreciate you. Do you think getting Your Inform Antonio in Valencia... Head. Uh, right back on seven chem is worth it for sure. Oh, another board from a pre-order pack. Okay. All right. That works. Yeah, it works. Gone, 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 gone. Sale. Yeah, see, I don't want Son on seven chem. The point is, as much as possible, to have my attackers on full chem. I want to try and figure something out where I can have my DMs be off of chem. I think I might need that, actually, if I'm switching song around. So let me, uh, let me hold on to that. Another Ulrich. Unreal. Uh, you worth anything, buddy? Not really. See you later. Merry Christmas to you guys, man. That's pretty sweet for me, I will, I will say. I know a lot of people are going to hate saying that De Bruyne is crazy expensive. I think the Raul is nutty expensive. The fact that's... I think that, that looked as if it was going to be an inform. I don't know why. I'm losing my damn mind. That Raul being pretty much the same price as his sellable card on the market, whether or not you get packs from it, I think is ridiculous. But this De Bruyne being cheaper than his lower rated card seems to be slightly more appealing. I still think it's a bit, it's a bit nutty expensive. KDB isn't worth about um, 600K. Well, you, I, you guys are saying 500K. I think maybe the way I did it, it just seems to be a little bit more expensive, but even, even five, 500K is, it's a hell of a lot of coins. It's just, at least he's a meta card, you know? At least he's full meta. Like, he's not only full meta, but as a lot of people have mentioned, he's an endgame card, right? can't believe I've, I'm going to have done Son for 250k and De Bruyne for 500k, like, or 200k. So I've got 700k in an 86 De Bruyne, and, uh, sorry, 86 Son and 93 De Bruyne. Oh, I'm fully caught up in the Futmus hype, aren't I? Am I doing this? Am I doing this, buddies? Am I doing this? I think I am. I honest I honestly think I should be doing this, bros. It isn't really coin burning if it's a first owner RTG. It still is though, dude. You you can't you can't even make that argument. And and the reason why I'm saying you can't make that argument is because I could use those 500k elsewhere for Johan Cruyff, for Prime Dino, for 
whatever, Clarence Sadorf, if and when he comes out, right? shot me in the head. Tom Baird, thank you for the four, man. Appreciate you. I need to figure out why um, DeMarbe is crazy money, though. That that's That's a confusing one for me. Why the heck is he so much? And do I have a different option? All right. So. Hell is awesome. Great. <clears throat> Watch Nick pack a regular De Bruyne from his squad battle rewards just because he is evil. <laughs> Hey, you know what, man? Possible. Very possible. I wouldn't be too upset about that because that would, you know, it would save things. Um, save things for sure. Uh, okay. It would drop the price by 200, 200K or get me. Why are you so much? Why is he so much? Someone explain him. Explain him to me. All right. Did we say it was like 70? Oh no! Bro, what? Oh, my God, I gotta filter through all this crap. That does not make me happy in the least. Holy Jesus, how much is that inform PK now? Is he actually 100K? That's a problem. That's a problem. Am I overpaying? I'm 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 overpaying here for sure. PK was actually 98k a couple of minutes ago. I sold mine for 100 k The market's actually oh okay. What the hell? <laughs> okay. Wait, what? Oh, whatever, man. Whatever, dude. ZX86 is 70K right now even? Okay, so the market is just nuts. A lot of people trying to do this card. Okay, I'm not overpaying. In fact, I've probably saved a little bit of cash money. El Sharawi. Go pick him up. Oh, God. Again. Hey, man. I hate, the, I hate these UCL cards. Purely because of this, though. What is this? Whatever. You need five informs. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, you do. Imagine in 2019, there isn't a filter for team of the week, team of the year, team of the season, UCLs, etc. They even have it on NHL and Madden. You know why, man? Because we're EA's piggy bank. We're EA's cash cow. Uh, on Madden and NHL, they actually have to work hard to keep their users and to make them happy and to give them good things like toppers, where you spend 12,000 FIFA points and you get yourself a guaranteed inform pack. On foot! We get that stuff two, three, four, five years later. Why? Because we're their cash cow. We spend money on this game even though we've had the same game for 10 years. On Madden and NHL, they have to work hard to keep people happy. So those that user base actually gets really good stuff in the game. FIFA, they don't need to do shit. We're all morons as it is. So why would they change anything when we're still going to be buying packs like it's crazy, right? The Madden and NHL guys just care. It's not that... Honest to God, dude, that is the reason why that's the case. Um, I am absolutely overpaying on this card, dude. But... Oh, that. Um, dude, why? I don't know why I'm... Is there e another card? Sports. What in the fuck is this game? Yes, Nick2018. Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna look. 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 Uh CDM inform German. What do we got? Oh, never mind. You can't search for informs. 
So Demar Bay or anybody else. Royce. Can you use a Royce? Gundo. Um, not really, huh? Okay, what about the center mid then? Gundo. Hoffman. Oh, you know what it is? Yeah, that's exactly what it is. It's just because of the player of the month, right? It's because it's Royce has these prices high. I'm pretty sure it's Royce that just has these prices high, right? He's still in he's still in packs. Hmm. That's annoying. Uh-huh. Sorry? What the hell? It's Sancho? Sancho's still available, dude? Wait, Sancho? I'm gonna try Hoffman for a sec. I mean, it's it's even worth the... I mean, Sancho. Is, this, is it this guy? No, which Hoffman is it, dudes? Is it 1F? Multiple Fs right now. Yeah, this guy. God's sakes. Dude, I don't even want to spend the 30k, bro. Yeah, let me let me let me go see if Hoffman even works. I I, I dropped one rating in terms of the CBs and it didn't work. So let's see if we drop one rating for Hoffman if it does anything. No, it doesn't. Oh, baby girl. Let's go. Good shit. Hey, saves us a little bit of cash. He's not going to work. Ha ha ha. You probably feel like a dumb stupid now, hey? <laughs> oh, he's still overpriced, dude. What the? F Bro, what? That's so shit. That actually makes me irritated. Yeah, I'm going to go... I'll go look at Subasic. No worries. Done deal. We're doing them, bros! We're doing them! We, I wanted to do a draft today. I wanted to do the Silver Squad Builder. And they had to drop this De Bruyne. Oh my god, are we doing it? Are we actually getting rid of Cruz? The only card I might regret here is this Cruz. He wasn't great. And the only place that Cruz works is at left DM. And I've got about a thousand players. I've got like a thousand players that fit into left DM. Yo, are we going up to 2K likes? I think we are. I think we are going up to 2K likes, boys. Finally, we came out. We we, we got some use out of All Black as well. Untradeable, Ter Stegen and Loris. Same thing for this donkey. He can go now. I'm out. You know what? Let's effing send it, bros. All right? We're going to do this for the coral. We're picking up a blonde-haired slash ginger, ginger, ginger de Bruyne for the coral. Let's go. Full solidarity, boys. 2K bits. Oh, my God, man. All right, we did it. 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 There's no turning back now. There's no turning back now. Merry Christmas, Nick 28T and the poor man Road to Glory. This is my present to the series, bros. 500k spent on Chris MD. <laughs> kind of does look like Chris MD, doesn't he? God, does he look good in a uh, Leeds United kit as well. Hell yeah, man. Hell yeah. So good. Let's go, boys. Hey, we needed to do it, man. Merry Christmas to the Road to Glory. I guess we're sticking with the first owner RTG, brothers. I think we're sticking to the first owner RTG. We just we just made that decision. Kevin! Yo, that that um that promo with De Bruyne running around doing the home alone stuff was great. Fair. No. 
This is a glitch, right? Dude, this is a glitch, right? Has to be. Honestly, my dick almost fell off. I'm not gonna lie. My dick almost fell off there. Madness. Okay, so one thing I noticed that I was getting melted in Weekend League with this team, because this team hasn't really changed, other than taking out Rivaldo and putting in De Bruyne, that's the only change for this Dream Team currently. My DMs, not one of them has a high attacking work rate. Not one of them. So I'm actually tempted. I'm actually tempted to do this. Even to test it out for the weekend league. So he'll be our right, he'll be our right DM. And then he'll be our left DM. What do you guys think? Or we can be just as psychotic and put Fernandinho in the setup. So this is the thought process. For now, we can use Fernandinho. So we use Fernandinho for the first 10 games of Weekend League coming up. And then we uh, we bring on Keen for the final 20. What do you guys think? And then if I like Keen, maybe we do him. I'm not the biggest fan of Keen IRL. Like, I never, I never was. But... Could do that. Is this card worth using, bros? Right here. The goddamn fucking moose shot me in the head. Medium high, four star weak foot's legit. Just give him an anchor. Anchor is low 70s at pace and acceleration and stuff. Really high stats defensively. Poor heading, but who really cares there? And he's got good passing. No, he's awful? Dude, on paper, other than pace, he seems better than Fabinho. Seems better than Fabinho, being the key word. Poor stamina? 79. But he's medium high. He's going to be staying back. So... I mean, the irony is... I, if you asked me before looking at his stamina, what Fabinho's stamina was, I would have been like, oh, probably the same as Fernandinho, like 70, 75. He's dead in the 70th minute or 60th minute. This guy's got 93 stamina? Since when? Since when, dude? Since effing when? All right. Okay. Fabinho's never dead for me. Dude, he is for me, man. I, I still use him all game, but that guy gets gassed super fast. Just try him. Yeah, I think, I mean, we'll test him out. We'll test him out. This team might change a little bit. Like, something might might shift. Because what I what I could do here is, is if I wanted to go with something a little bit, not original, but if I wanted to go with something a little bit different, I could also toss Keen here and go with like another right mid if I wanted to, like a Jaden Sancho or get Robin back in the setup or 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 whatever, right? So we could do a whole bunch of different different stuff here. There's no real rules with the squad setup. Why replace Fabinho with Fernandinho? Fabinho with Fernandinho. Um just just to try out just to te just to test something out hi i'm recording hi what's up bubba wow what is that look at this dudes look at this can i hang that up on the wall can i actually oh ethan you're invisible again <laughs> you're floating head again dude oh my oh oh, oh god is that orange orange yes justice i love you buddy okay and look at this one too look i haven't hung up this one either look ethan made me these two you know what man this is the best thing to do to get for recordings love daddy to daddy love ethan that's me with my current beard and then that's this is to dad. This wait is... oh oh you said this yep. is to daddy love ethan hi oh and Ethan made my favorite superhero, the only Batman. the only awesome one, Batman. That's Batman right there. He's and then using the grappling hook. Oh yeah, to baby. Go up and get Joker. 
Oh, and that's Joker? I thought that was you. I don't know. I thought maybe you were Robin. I thought Robin was stranded. Robin always gets into trouble, right? He doesn't know how to be a superhero. It's because Robin's a beta and Batman a isn't. Beta. A, uh, it's way back. What's this way back? You don't remember who Zway is? You know what? Neither do I. I haven't oh. talked to Zway in a year or so. Yeah. Zway, you Zway. know? Well, the last time we FaceTimed me, you, and Zway was when we were in Germany, right? Remember? You, you don't even probably remember that. That was like a year ago. Now, that's when Zway was a good friend. We used to hang out. We used to cuddle. We used to watch nature documentaries in Germany together. And then we talked to you. That's when Zway was a good friend. Now, I don't know where Zway is anymore. He's busy playing Call of Duty by himself on stream. Doesn't talk to me or Nep anymore. What do you think about that? What would you do if you had a friend like Zway where you're like, you know he's your best friend, but you haven't talked to him in a year. What would you say to him? What would you do? I would... Hey, Zway, what's up? What you been doing lately? I would say Zway, I'd say, Oh, hey, buddy, I've just been uh, screaming at cockroaches. Not bad. I've asked his way to play Fortnite and he still said no. I know. See? that? Wow. That is the reaction that I did and said. I was so disappointed. At least Nep is a good friend. He wants to play Fortnite with me all the time. At least. Exactly. At least Nep is. All right, buddy. I love you. Bye. Do you want to do an outro or are you going to, are you going to, are you going to. Look at this hair, man. Okay, go, 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 go. I'm going to keep you here forever. This video is going to be five hours long. Love you. Bye. <laughs> All right, well, there, I, dude, man, <coughs> I don't know, like, stuff like that obviously happens on stream all the time. Mid-recording, I don't know what the heck, like, do I, do we keep it in the video? Do I edit it out? The start of the intro today, where I literally just didn't do an intro and got confused for three minutes, do I edit that stuff out? What do I do, or do I just keep it all in there, man? I don't know. Is, is that stuff too cringe for you guys? I'm not I'm not entirely sure. I mean, it is Christmas, right? So it can't be that cringy. Nick edit as if, hey, dude, just because I haven't edited a poor man road to glory video in three years doesn't mean I don't know how to edit. To be fair, I if there is editing, I let Swedish do it for me. Swedish is my editor now. I don't have time, bro. Um, all right, Bodart, him, Bodart. Bodart the botch more like. All right, this is absolutely turning into cringe miss. Oh, gee. Oh, that probably would have given us a sneak peek as as to what card we were going to get. Hey, EA, can I exchange my Funmas card for this God card? What in the hell? Bro, what is this card? Holy moly, dude. What is this card actually, though? 99 stamina, 91 strength. Goddamn fucking moose shot me in the head. I wonder if, like, Debrina actually has that card. You know? If it's in his club and if he even uses it. Or maybe he gave it to, like, one of his nephews. Or, you know, gave the account to... It, it, well, his kids, I think, are young, right? Did I do the KDB? There's your answer right there, brother. <coughs> All right. Well, I don't think I'll be doing a draft today uh, hey, for man. this epi. And in terms of a silver team, I'm going to build a silver team on stream with my viewers next episode, which will be, uh, next episode will be, you guys are not going to get a poor man road to glory recording tomorrow. I know that you get this recording for Christmas, but know that I'm recording on Christmas Eve, right? So that I can have this uploaded for Christmas. Um, so that's what's gonna happen so tomorrow christmas i might go i might live stream christmas day for like half an hour or an hour just to say merry christmas to my viewers and to you guys and stuff like that but i'm not going to be doing any youtube stuff so tomorrow there's probably going to be like a stream highlights slash ultimate 2018 stream slash nick 2018 rage funnies video that swedish is gonna we're, we're planning and trying to put that together which should be super uh super enjoyable so i will say as a final much love to you guys. Merry Christmas. I hope you do enjoy tomorrow's video, which will be like a Boxing Day slash Christmas Day type of video for highlights and all of that stuff. And you guys are amazing, man. I appreciate you all. And...
this is what I'm going to do for the YouTube video. If you've made it here, which is genuinely an hour tail end of this recording, probably only a few thousand of you guys make it all the way here. So what I will say is we'll do a sneaky hundred dollar Christmas giveaway for the comments section. All you got to do though, so that you get to be a part of it, the guys that made it here. And I guess the Twitch viewers that watch this recording will probably come to the video to take part as well. However, if the video gets 40k views or whatever like it normally does there's probably only going to be five to six or seven k of you guys that'll be able to participate in this okay so we're going to do two separate 100 dollars paypal giveaways for you guys okay for this christmas video all you got to do is like the video okay and in the comments section just put your favorite christmas movie whatever your favorite christmas movie is that's it whether it's Elf, which we watched yesterday at our at, at our family party, whether it's Home Alone 1, Home Alone 2, if you put anything else, I don't respect you as much as a human being, but, you know, put whatever you want, <coughs> and that's it, okay, so we'll do two separate $100 PayPal, um, die hard, <laughs> two separate PayPal $100 giveaways for the video, like, put your, put your favorite movie in there, I'm just gonna, I'm literally just gonna scroll through the comments, and I'll pick, uh, a, a random winner, and then we'll click that random winner's comment and then make sure that they've liked the video. Um, and then that's how you're going to win the, the $100 via PayPal. And then Twitch, I'm going to do a little surprise giveaway for you guys as well, okay? So let's get these packs opened. We've got Elite 3, which is, I guess, okay for squad battles. Not going to mean we get anything crazy from them. But hey, we get a board to finish things off. Okay, never Benega, why not? Toss them in the club if I don't have them already. If I do have them already... I'm going to put them on the trade pile. I'm not going to sell. Okay. So, boom. Sergio Leon. The god, the goat of the series for this year, for sure. Harry Potter. Harry Potter is good stuff, isn't it? What's the two-player packs and a mega pack? That is not bad for playing, what, five, six, seven games of, of squad battles throughout the week? Pretty decent. Oh, my. Okay. So, next player pack, we don't get anything out of that. That's fine. Come on, EA. Mega pack, we're going to get an icon, dudes. I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. If I do get uh, an icon or something awesome, I'll make it a $500 giveaway. Okay, dudes? So it's $200 giveaway right now for this Christmas video. This is something good. It's going to be 500 bones. To Well, $100 to five separate winners. Please. EA don't want your Christmas to be good, dudes. Unfortunately, no walkout. Oh my god, dude. Wow, that tease. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Ya Habibi. Okay. I guess that works. I guess that works for me. I get the benefit. You guys don't. I get the benefit. You guys don't. All right. Anyways, I love you dudes. Merry Christmas. Thank you so much for the support this year. And we'll catch you guys on the flip side on Boxing Day. That'll be the next recording for The Poor Man Road to Glory. Peace!